Hello, friends of BAM! I know we played this yesterday, but, uh... Well, you'll see. I did some good work between then and now, and, uh... I was just so excited to show you. So we're gonna do this tonight, tomorrow night, for the extra long stream. We're gonna do Breath of the Wild, and then next week we're gonna reintroduce Spyro. So, that's gonna be fun. Let's start the new season off right by saying hello to my little skunky boy! Hello, skunky boy! Hello, skunky! Okay, so, as you can see, it is now autumn. I stopped on autumn first. I was gonna keep going and really grind up some mining, but I didn't want to do that to you. You know, uh, I haven't been into town because... So technically, I, well, I did go into town on one occasion and then reset the game and avoided going into town because there are multiple cutscenes awaiting us when we go out and about. And, uh, you know, that's just a thing that we have to live with now. We're gonna be... Oh, yeah. We're gonna be doing some good stuff, so... First and foremost, what do we have? What do we have? We've got a couple of dead ones. I guess I have to smash them. Okay. There we go. So we don't, we lost a couple. Petunia seeds. When do you plant? Summer. Okay, so those are out now. You may have noticed, well, I'll show you in a second, what you may have noticed. Uh, Petunia seeds, you know what, yeah, you can go there, that's fine. Uh, you may have noticed that there's an extra box up there, and you may be thinking to yourself, well, whatever could she be doing with another box? And, well, I will show you in just a moment, whatever I could be doing with another box. You might be thinking... Did she really get so many things in a couple of days of grinding that she needed another box? And the answer would be yes. But it's a box for very specific things. Specifically, it's entirely full of objects. Yeah. You saw that right, my friends. That's just from scooping puddles. I wasn't digging in the mines. I wasn't, uh, going out there doing anything crazy. Nope, just, okay, summer and autumn. Tomatoes also summer and autumn. I specifically have been making seeds for tomatoes, uh, green peppers and eggplants because they are good for two seasons. Those were the things that I had that said summer and autumn. And I said, thank you, game. So, looks like there was room to sow seeds there. We're going to focus on the areas that are already going to be watered. I did not, however make my list of wild animals that we will need to photograph. So, you know, at some point, we'll, we'll get around to that. <sighs> but first, we're gonna water our crops, and then I think, you know what, we're probably gonna be planting more, so let's head, let's go see Reyna, clear all this stuff out, get it all appraised, and then we'll go to uh, the general store. You might be thinking, well, why didn't you do these things while you were grinding? Well, friends, these are the places where the cutscenes are happening. Hey, so you do, do you remember that historical exhibit we were going to put on? You know, the one Gloria totally shut down? That was a bummer and all, but we should at least have a party to celebrate it. I only worked that hard on it because I thought we were going to have a party afterwards. But I need some help to get this thing off the ground, and I thought you'd be willing. 
You're down for that, right? It'll be fine, I promise. Uh, yeah, I'm totally- I'm a total party animal. <laughs> Thanks! Friends are the best! By the way, can you dance? Why do I ask? Because at this party, we're gonna be dancing till dawn. We're gonna have plenty of drinks on the house and music to last us the whole night. Trust me, my playlist is gonna turn some serious heads. We'll have it, like, on the beach, or maybe just a little ways into the forest. Don't worry, I'll set everything up. Gazing at the stars, dancing till morning, doesn't it sound awesome? I'll put everything together so you can, like, advertise for it? I still have work here that needs to be done, so it'll be your job to let everyone know about it. Let's see, maybe you could dance around to draw everyone's attention. I'll leave the details up to you. Oh, I'm so excited, I can't wait! You cannot have a party for an exhibit that does not exist, Reyna. What? Why didn't you tell me that sooner? I shouldn't have to tell you, dear. It's common sense. Aww. And that's it. Reyna's just poor, sweet, dumb idiot. Oh, my dear. Oh! My dearest, silliest dear. Oh. Eh. Oh. Now we're gonna get about 40 things from her, and then we're gonna go put those away, and we'll come back another day to, uh, oh. get more. Oh. You know? I might do the rest, I might leave some of them for between streams, because, like, oh. as long as there's not a cutscene, it doesn't matter. And I know this is super annoying. I mean, fun. It's super fun, right? Oh. It's so super fun to watch me spam click through a thing. Oh. Hooray. Oh. Oh. I don't know why I gave her that, like, sexy, deep voice. Oh. When the game gave her this super high-pitched one. Oh. 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 Do do. Sorry, had an important text to send. There we go. Oh. Done now. Alrighty. So. We're almost done oh. with Reyna. I, oddly enough, did not get to the 999 oh. stone. But that's because I didn't find time to go mining. Oh. I was literally, like, the plan was to do that the next day, and then I realized the next day was the start of a new season. Oh. So, uh... Yeah. Oh. But that's okay. I did realize that we need to get um, more bricks underway. I thought that that oh. 150 was way overkill, but no, because we need 20 of the, oh. um, oh, where are my notes? The suction pumps. 20 suction pumps to get oh. that uh, hydro planting facility handled. All right, Hello. you got anything that you want? No, nothing, okay, bye. Oh, my dear. You big dumb idiot, wow. Reyna. If you have a bucket, you can totally scoop dirty water out of lakes if you see them. It's up to us to keep all of town beautiful. That's true. It is. <laughs> it is up to us. And by us, I mean me. As do you. We all need me. What sounded really passive-aggressive? Yeah. And then, now the day that I stumbled upon this one, it was raining. So, nope, here we are. Howdy, here to do some shopping? Actually, are you hungry by any chance? I made some stew for last night's dinner, but wouldn't you know it, I made far too much of the stuff. I can vouch for the flavor. It's good stuff, I promise. So how about it? Would you like some? Don't mind if I do. You're a doll, Emilio. Trust me, you're doing me a big favor. 
I don't know what this scene is. If this is an Emilio Hart scene, or if this is something that just would have happened eventually. My folks can't handle rich food like they used to, so they aren't eating as much these days. And little Cindy is hardly the type to wolf her food down. Never has been. Jack's the only one I can count on to eat any decent amount of food, but he likes to eat out sometimes. The problem is, he never warns me beforehand. I toil away over a hot stove, and what do I get come supper time? Sorry, Mom, I already ate. Can you believe it? I could have sworn I raised him to be more considerate than that. For me, it's really special to watch someone enjoy your cooking. But cooking together with someone is even more special. I tried to teach Jack how to cook, but that boy couldn't tell salt from pepper. I'm hoping I'll have more luck with Cindy's lessons. How about you, Emilio? Have you ever thought about taking cooking lessons? You're welcome to drop by my place in the evenings. I'd be more than happy to teach you what I know. Nice, in that case, maybe you could give me a trial lesson, and if I end up getting the hang of it, we'll keep, on, keep it going. Would that be cool with you? Yes, that sounds wonderful. I'm looking forward to it. Anyway, thanks again for taking some of that stew off my hands. Oh, why hello there, Lexiac. Would you be interested in a bowl of stew? There's plenty to go around. Yeah, so I actually did watch through that when, when it came up. But I don't know what that's meant to be. Ah. I mean, it, it's entirely possible that it could just be story, you know? It, it could totally just be story. But, like, is Angela just lonely? I mean, we know her husband's not, not in the picture. Whether he has, is, has passed on, or if he left, or whatever. Um, but so we know he's not in the picture because he doesn't live with them. He's the only one not around, and nobody really talks about him. Um... Sure, let's get some spinach seeds. Autumn and winter. Okay, see, carrots are gonna be good. Yeah, no, 16 is all that. Okra. Sweet potatoes. We'll focus in on the carrots, most likely. Spring, summer, and autumn for the radishes, but, you know, I don't really care. And then, what can we get? We'll get two of each seedling that's available. Oh, it's just those two? Crap, so I had come in, I should've waited, I should've, I should've stopped today early. I had come in, in in summer and there were a lot of different seedling types. And I was gonna get two of everything and really start with the orcharding, but. They switched it up, come fall. So here we are. <sighs> so here's the problem, okay? I'm running out of space for orcharding. And it might seem like, well that's an easy fix. Orchard more, but my fields are here. And that might seem like, well that's an easy <gasps> fix. Except, I don't wanna lose all these crops. Excuse me, but you need to move. Anyway, so as I was saying... Uh, so I'm thinking... That the field needs to be moved. Maybe not immediately but soon. So let's just plant as much. There we go. As we can plant. And then water everything. And once we uh, get more of our tools upgraded, the plan will be to migrate the field up to the middle area once we have moved some of our animals to other areas and speaking of animals boy howdy do we have some good stuff to do okay so 
Looks like we got a little overzealous with our shopping. It's fine, there are worse things in the world. There are way worse things in the world than having too many seeds for your, your farm. You know? You know what I'm saying? Oh, you know what I'm saying. Which is good because I don't know what I'm saying. Is this an empty space? No. Alrighty, so. Next. Boy, Hattie, wouldn't you believe it? There's a bunny. Uh oh. Uh, what are we gonna name our bunnies? We've already got fruits, vegetables, flowers, gemstones. We could do metals. Should I name my rabbits after metals? The irony is, yeah. Yeah, the irony of naming the smallest, softest creatures after metals. Not lost on me. Yeah, the iron E. The problem is that now I don't have any facilities to accommodate my animals in. Okay, pull my chickens, call out the chickens. And there are so many animals, so what we need to do is go talk to Nigel. And then we'll come take care of the animals. Uh, I didn't let any of my animals fornicate. I bought new ones. And only of a couple. I love my skunky boo. My little skunky boo. <laughs> oh, Nigel! Nigel Uno! Hello! Uh. Ten gold, fifty tough, ten something. What if I just get a new barn? Oh! Uh, I can just buy them. He's gonna put them in my inventory and I can set them down. Oh my god! That was so easy! I thought I was gonna have to wait for him to build them the next day. Do you know what this means? Do you know what this means? Oh, this is exciting. I can just start these in the back area where I want them all to end up in the first place. Excuse me, excuse me, bye. Bye, goodbye, I love you all. Oh boy, howdy. Boy, howdy do. Smash. Now I kind of want these like as far in the straight back as they can go. Um, milk. Confirm. Can I move my animals around from... Hold on. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have a milk, a wool, a whatever. <laughs> yes. Yes. Ah. Oh, this is so exciting. Okay, wool. 
confirm the name. You go and we'll... I don't know what we get from the rabbits. Let's see. It doesn't say. I'm gonna move the rabbit to wool for now. Because I can't imagine what else we would get from them. We're not slaughtering them. We better not be slaughtering them. <laughs> anyway... So as you can see, we've done a, a lot of clearing here. I Did I get a picture of the monkeys? <sighs> I don't think I did. Crap on a cracker. Oh. And the beach is... Holy a mess. Durable lumber and tough grass. I have that. I don't have that. I think it's just the supple lumber that I need, oddly enough. <laughs> But I think I have for the silo. You know what? We'll just go get all the stuff. Um, hi. Alpine goat. Goats are for milking, right? Bye. Uh, oh, what do I need my goat? Uh-oh. Uh. Rocky. Nope. Uh, Pebble. They're just going to be named after different stone features. Pebble, rock, stone, boulder. You know. There we go. We've got a goat. Oh, you know what? I should put my coop in, too. No, wait. Sure. Sure, I'm just gonna tear it down anyway. I'll put all my barns over there. Go <gasps> here. Uh. Eggs. They're all eggs. Unless we get, like, silkworms or something, which we have had in the past. So, it's a... It's, it's not an unreasonable assumption that we might have, like, silkworms or something that doesn't produce eggs that goes into a coop. <sighs> Horse, I will get you soon. Hopefully. I don't actually know that with certainty. Um, so yeah, this area, I cleared out all this stuff. This was the mirage trees and mirage grass, and it is, I think that that area is the only place where it grows, A, and B, it, they don't seem to grow quickly or frequently. Okay, you're new though, right? Goat. Um. Uh, give it fodder and it'll produce mild, delicious goat milk. You go and milk. You are also a goat, so you will be stone. Pebble and stone. Confirm. Into the milk barn. Thank you. What? Teleported me to the milk barn. It's goofy. I guess so that I can, you know, care for my new animal. So how many animals did we just get? Oh, we need the cow. The Jersey cow. Jersey cow. Alright. Um. Oh, crap. Oh. There's one space left in the milk barn. We may have to go, like, cows in one and goats in the other. But that's fine, too. It's all fine. Ah, so. Uh, we've got ruby, sapphire. Let's go emerald. Fuck. 
Four new animals today. Things just got a little wild on the farm. <laughs> wink wonk, wild. Whoops, wrong way. So we didn't get to do any cleaning today. Dang it, nor did we get to, uh... Iron. Carrot. Banana. Ruby. It might behoove me to care for the animals in the barn before releasing them. Because at this point, I have no idea who's where or what's why. You know? Okay. And so there are no more animals connected to either of these facilities. So now we can pick those up, move them over. Um, I hope you all find your way to your new homes. Cause, uh... I won't be leading the way. I guess technically I will be leading the way. Ha! So. Barn number three. Okay, this barn will be cow. Confirm. We will now... I need to change the name of milk to goat. So everyone will go here. Did you get lovins? No. Nor did either of my goats. They need food. Okay, so I need three fodder. Nope, not wool. Wool is not the problem. Milk is the problem. <gasps> Boink. Okay. Confirm. Now... We move the goats into goat house. The animals will now be moved. Uh, yeah. Wait. One more chicken coop. No, you can't fit there. Okay. Mother. Father, there's so much work that goes into this. It's almost like rearranging all the buildings on a farm takes effort and time and consideration. I mean, yikes, am I right? I'll just put a question mark on this for now because I don't know what's going to go into it. Gold. Awesome possum. So I got four new animals, but I saw the rabbit outside, hanging out with the chickens and my other animals, which means that we only need food for three of them tonight. Theoretically, they would have eaten before I tamed them, but I don't trust the game. Welcome to the family, have some deluxe fodder. All right, so we didn't get much done today, except for 
moving the buildings, but... You know what? We moved the buildings, we had a couple of cutscenes, we planted a lot. I think we've got plenty done. One there for you. Hopefully the correct animal eats it, but, you know, we'll find out. Into- no, not into wool. Bye. Into... goat. Hello, goats. Goodbye, goats. It was very great to meet you. Alright, everyone happy? We had a great time today? Awesome. Love to hear it. Let's bucket some stuff. We don't really have time to bucket stuff. Eh, we're gonna bucket some stuff anyway. And if you think the buckets are nasty, then boy howdy can you be friends. That's a home stuff I get it. It's fine. It's been a while since I read it too. Blammo, blammo, blammo. Kerplow. Uh, Kerblam. Oh, bag's full. I guess it is. Uh, not anymore. Smooth grass. What do you mean smooth grass? What do you mean, smooth grass? I didn't know that that existed. <sighs> okay then. We're not putting anything into any of these makers until they're empty and moved because we will be moving all of our makers also to the back area. Nope. Mm. Okay, hard things. This. Okay, but like the trash. What am I supposed to be doing with the trash? Oh, I had plenty of smooth grass. I'm just an idiot. And you know what? Sometimes that's okay. Sometimes you just need to be dumb. Oh my goodness! I've got all these things to sell. I was saving them up. Special for you, friends. Special for you. Okay, that's man-made, but didn't come from a maker. That's man-made, but didn't come from a maker. Uh, the town metals are gonna be sold. Um, that's man made and did come from a maker. What seeds are these? Spinach? Carrot? Oh, no, those need to be put in the place where apparently we're putting seeds now. And this? Yeah, you know what? We are gonna actually put the eggs in there. Because I know those will be done by the time we get up in the morning. Okay, everything else, that's a no for me, dog. Okay, light. Light, light. Alright, we got plenty of good stuff. We're gonna make a decent amount of money, even though we did not a whole lot today, because of all this stuff that I've been hoarding. See that? 32,000. 32,000. Isn't that golden? Ugh. Isn't that just lovely? Isn't that just... We just did a lovely thing. Had a great first day. Whew. Okay, so. We're going to repair the silo and the beehive. Today. As well as go get some of our tools. 
profit puller. 30,000 in one day. That's the way, friends. So are you saying that I should save up my junk and aim for like 100,000 in one day? Love it when I don't have to water things. Which is why we're working so hard to get sprinklers set up, by the way. There. Lovely. Love that. Love every part of it. No. Get everything put away. We want to have a nice, empty bag. While we get our stuff sorted. Seven star seeds! Uh, I need to get those planted as soon as possible. What are those metals? Crap. Okay, that's fine. Um, so, plan for today. Oh, we really need to tidy up first. Alright, well, let's tidy up a little. Should have gone the other way. That's okay. Okay. We should be able to tidy everything up pretty quickly, though, now that everything's basically done in the back area. But nonetheless, I think as long as after noon, we head to see Clemens. They're not closed on Mondays. I don't remember what day they're closed, but it's either Tuesday or Thursday, like everything else, basically. And that's all that matters. That's all I need to know. Is that they're not closed today. Get some chestnuts. Roasting on an open fire, preferably. I don't think that it was because you poked me so much as I think like that spot in particular happens to be sore. Sorry, uh, Chad just poked me and accidentally hurt me. But, uh, I'm okay. Cannot wait to turn this all into crop. Because that's what the second area is going to be now. Which is why we're going to upgrade our axe and hoe. Those are the two we're gonna do first. Axe for obvious axing reasons. And our hoe for rebuilding our entire field from the ground up. It's gonna be glorious. Bye. Okay, so this area there. Bop. Ugh. This is just so satisfying to me. Just doing the work. Having a grand old time. Thinking that you messed it all up and then realizing you didn't. Alrighty, so. Axe this. Bucket this. And then sickle that. And the first two areas are done. We'll go feed our animals and then we'll head up to the clutch. Lovely babes need to be fed and 
loved on as they deserve. Eh, I saw that log. Nope. Oregano does not belong here either. That does. And these do. But sap goes here. And all the rest of this nonsense goes here. Bonk, bonk. Uh, yeah. Okay, so, fodder. Oh, geez, we're almost out of fodder. <gasps> I need to get fodder seeds. Well, we're in town today. I never thought that I would run out of fodder. I didn't, you know, expect it to rain every day. My goodness. Holy moly. Oh, I should have brought all this. You know what? We're gonna repair these things now, too. Durable lumber, tough grass, bricks, and silver ingots. That's what we need. So. The tough grass, if I counted right, we need 50 of. Silver ingot, 20 bricks, and 20 durable lumber. Okay, now we can go. Care for our animals, repair those two buildings, then go see Nigel. My god, is he even still gonna be open? Beehive. Oh crap. Okay, wait, I can go back and see what it said. It said... Setting a flower by a beehive will draw bees to it. After a few days, you'll be able to harvest the honey-covered hives. See? Good thing there's lag, am I right? I've unlocked the beekeeping skill. So nothing's in here yet, right? Awesome, love that. Love to see it. I don't know where I'm gonna put the beehive, but I'm gonna put it somewhere. We're gonna have still three chickens. That's, right. That's fine. So. Thanks, love you. Ooh. Okay. Daisy gets a double. Lily. I love that the silky is they just took the regular chicken and put them in grayscale. Love that. What does the dilapidated silo do for me? Large amounts of fodder can be stored in the silo. Por qué? I don't understand. Pebble. Stone. Oh. Hit the wrong button the second time. Love. Uh, thought that they were milkable. Maybe not every day. Wool. Ah, uh, yes, I was right about the rabbit. Alpaca wool. So we've got wool, alpaca wool, and rabbit fur. What are we gonna do with rabbit fur? I guess make rabbit yarn. That's not weird at all. Except for the part where it is, in fact, very weird. Huh? Did one of you eat uh, Emerald's food? Emerald, I'm sorry if they didn't let you eat. Poor baby turds. 
Let Emerald eat. Okay, let's go see Nigel. It's only three, we'll make it. I don't know why I was running like a lunatic. I was trying to see if there were any animals on the beach. But alas, there were nay. <laughs> nay. Get it like a horse? <laughs> I'm not funny. What am I doing? Stop. We're going to see Nigel. Or Clemens. We're going to see Clemens, not Nigel. Get your gold. And your durable lumber, I believe. Ugh. <gasps> Let's hope it was supple. Oh, it is supple. Durable is for the aura calcium upgrades. Okay, so we can upgrade two things. We have enough gold for two upgrades. We knew that that would be the case. Oh, hi. Thank you for coming, Lexiac. During my thousand year slumber, I reverted to my child form. I am the spirit of this spring. This land was blessed by many spirits long ago, but it seems they are no longer here. Perhaps they yet sleep. It was by the Earth Sprite's voices that I awoke once again. And all of you have awakened again without issue. We sure have! Lexiac woke us up. Lexiac's farm gives us lots of energy. Thanks to your efforts, the Earth Sprites can frolic and play. You have taken good care of them, and for that, I owe you my gratitude. I pray that you continue to look after them. I will. Indeed. Speaking of which, we should go see if we can get any new sprite unlocks. Hey. Upgrade my things. What did we say? Axe? Indeed. And ho! Right? Yeah. Fishing rod. We don't even use that thing. <sighs> I mean, we'll ob obviously upgrade it anyway, but... We don't even use that thing. Like some kind of monsters. Alrighty, let's go see the spirit. And then we'll go plant some bloopers. Some crops. That's what I meant. Plant some bloopers. Hi, spirit. Ah, good day to you, Lexiac. Your energy is as boundless as afternoon sunshine. I'm glad that you enjoy it. Okay, I boost my farm's level even further. Allows travel to Petalwind Gardens. Eversun Gardens. Red Maple Gardens. Hoarfrost Gardens. You what? Huh. Oh, you know what? I heard that there are places that you can get access to that the seasons don't change. So that's what these must be. Petal wind would be spring, ever sun, summer, red maple, autumn, hoarfrost, winter. Interesting. I don't care about that. We want these sprites. Chef, care, journey. Little wolf? I want a little wolf. A gorgeous horse? Ooh. Ooh. A little wolf, though. I can't even get a horse yet. Can I ride the wolf? Let's just boost my farm level. You know what? No. Let's save our stuff. What's a special prayer? Wait. What business do you have with me? Oh, I can change the animal's name. No thanks. Bye. Sick. Is that the regular fox or is that a different fox? Okay. Uh, it's an orange fox. There we go. Hi. 
Hi, Spirit. All right, let's stop making everyone dizzy now. Bye. <laughs> I made some of the tough cloth. So, oh, but they wanted five. I've only got like three. Just giving you my gold ingots, you monster. Let's go mine up that stone for him so he'll shut up and do the thing. It's not what we were planning on doing with the rest of the day, but it's what we're gonna do. Let's get the dang stone so the mayor will leave us alone. And by leave us alone, I mean trigger another cutscene and show us the nice things that can happen. Uh, here's a thought. Do, does using a different material change what happens to the town? With that in mind, it is recommended to turn on the TV to acquire. Once you turn on the set, it'll be continued the next day. Hold on. It doesn't say that anything is different. Okay. So we're gonna guess that it's not. And therefore, why would I waste my time? You know? I mean, come on, game. Why would I waste my good stuff when I can just give them garbage? When did I get so bad at mining? You know, like, when did I get so bad at this? Last stream. AKA yesterday. Bye. Okay. I see this shows promise. Gold ho. <gasps> I was supposed to buy fodder seeds. Turns out I'm a big dumb idiot. I just need like a hundred stone. The crusher. There we go. Let's go down one more floor. But I'm sure I had over 800. Oh, you know what? But I think I used some to make the box. Let's get to 200 just in case. I also love that there are three mines in this town and all three of them are on my property. I mean, it just doesn't get much better than that. Like, I have sole rights to all of the mineable property in this freaking town. No one else can use it without my permission. <laughs> Watch me become a tyrant, drunk with power. Oh, I'm absolutely drunk with power. What else would I be drunk with? I'm a farmer, what else would I be drunk with? Potatoes, actually, I've got plenty. What is it that's made from potatoes? Vodka? Yeah? Yeah, 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 yeah. So I could be drunk with potatoes, actually. I don't think I'm growing any potatoes. Hmm? What's happening? So, whoa! Uh, sorry, fixed it. Bonk. That actually helped me at all, but it felt fun. Oh, I guess we're just gonna clear the whole mine. I didn't even realize that. There's only ten levels here. 
Have we done that before? Yeah, I'm sure. And they give me like... Yeah, a couple of iron rocks. Alrighty. Let's go turn in the stuff. so cute and fun and I just freaking love it. Oh, okay, so they make a separate stack. I like that, I like that. It's red. Uh, let's put all this stuff away. It's fine. Stuff. All right, let's go give them the stuff they need. And then I guess tomorrow we will move the fields. Yeah. Oh, I have to go potty though. You know, we can start building the field up today. It's only 9 p.m. Bonk. Give that. Yes, indeed. 3,000. That means nothing to me, but I appreciate your uh, effort. Ding, 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 ding. I guess we've gotten a lot of stuff. Bye. Gold town medals. What do those sell for? Probably a thousand, right? Ooh, that's exciting. Oh yeah. Okay. Huh. Sorry, I looked down at my, you know, the, the counter telling you how long you've been live. And I watched it go from 57 minutes and 57 seconds down to 57 minutes and 56 seconds. And then continue upwards. Oh, they gave me another a butter maker and a gem jewel maker. Yes, game. Oh, this game knows how to get to me. One thousand each. Yes. Uh, yogurt, mayo. Those can go in the selling cellar. Rice seeds. Okay, we're gonna pause. I'm gonna go use the bathroom. We'll be right back. Alrighty, we are back from our potty break. We're gonna go hoe it up. 
It'll probably do a three by three square at this point, right? Like. Yeah. Oh my gosh, game. Wait, why didn't that work? Oh, I see. Okay. So to do this, I'm gonna have to get make more sprinklers. Just till it up. Oh yeah. This is going nicely though. crops real fast. Anything, any seeds we've got that are autumn seeds will get planted. Now! No, you're... Yes, summer and autumn. Autumn. Autumn and winter. Okay, so we want row three. I'm just curious as to why the first three rows are tan and the last one is that wood color. Doesn't matter. Because those are the spaces that are gonna have sprinklers in them. So. Those are the spaces that we want to not plant in. Our rice meant for spring, summer, and autumn. Let's go ahead and make some rice. Lovely. All right, let's go to bed. Everything's going wonderfully. This isn't a wonderful life. This is Pioneers of Olive Town. Silly game. Oh no, A Wonderful Life is another game in the series. Yeah. So, technically it's the ones that I've usually played as Harvest Moon. Uh, but they were only called Harvest Moon in the US. Or maybe North America entirely, I'm not sure. Um, but then when the- oh, hi Lars! <gasps> Lars. It's so Harvest Moon is story of seasons up until recently when the parent company got to keep the rights to the name, but the team that made the game split. Anyway, hi Lars! Welcome to my home. Whatever are you doing here? Yo, Lexiac, sorry to bug you at the crack of dawn. 
There was something I needed to check in with you about. Repairs on your bike are almost done, but we encountered one major snag. We kind of ran out of the necessary materials for repairs. I tried to place an order, but our supplier has no idea when the goods are going to be coming in. If you happen to get your hands on any of the materials, could you bring them over? It'd be a huge help. I'll post the list of materials we need up on the bulletin board, so check it out when you've got a sec. Lars, my dear, are you charging me for these repairs as well as making me provide materials? Because I will do one or the other, but not both. Skunkies! Let me bet you! Alright, so. Roses. Love them. Love them. Glad they weren't summer only like the sunflowers. Because boy howdy was that uh, unfortunate, we'll say. And it looks like a lot of these plants are dying. And we won't be replanting here. We will be replanting in the new fields. Yeah, pluck them. We need a lot more seed makers, which is why we need to get back down into the mine. All 20 seed makers up and running. So I had found a couple of round eggplants, and I believe I uh, thought that they were some sort of varietal. Put them in the seed maker, but it turns out that they just make multiple, like, more eggplant seeds than the regular eggplants. Did I just watch the color pop onto these tomatoes in front of my very eyes? Are these ones going to do the same? No, I guess not. Anyway. Uh, those can get sold. Yeah, those can get sold too. Now the eggplants and the tomatoes, I don't know, those might be the highest ones that I've got. Eight star roses? Oh my god. I mean, my god, man. All right, we're gonna be moving the fleet today, too. This being the fleet. Okay, so. I guess we'll save up our stuff for a bit. This is what we need. Okay, we have four star eggplants. There we go. We have uh, what star tomatoes? None. We don't have tomatoes. Yet. Uh oh, jeez. Well, the sugar doesn't belong in here. Nor does this. Nor does this. Nor this. Okay. So then the roses as well can go in there to be reseedified. And then the ingredients can go in here where they belong, where they should have been the whole time. You know, for all the cooking that I do. All right, well. Tomato seeds. Okay. Watering can. I see. Now I've got to water both fields for a little while. 
this. This is frustrating. I mean, again, you do what you gotta do, right? But... Who, baby? Is what you gotta do not fun? More green peppers? Love that. Oh. So I don't know if you can get three water. Same as here. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna refill anyway before I go over there. Cause then we're just gonna blast on by, let out the animals, care for them. And then go straight to the mine for the rest of the day. We'll do clean up another time. Oh, darn you, game. <clears throat> Okay. There we go. Alright. Done and doneer. I might even make another box to just keep up here to hold my stuff in when I need to go into the mine. Alrighty. Hey, beehive. What do you do? Huh. Well, we'll see what happens. All right, let's love on all these sillies. All these silly lilies. I guess I can place the makers. If I don't have space to make a box, that is. I did say we were gonna move the fleet, didn't I? Yay, goat milk! Goat milk! Interesting. Why are they different types of goats if they give me the same type of milk? The brown cow gives me the same type of milk as it gives me Jersey milk. Mm. Ooh, fancy milk! Yeah, just milk. Okay. Milk plus. Holy moly, look at all this new stuff we can make. Topiaries? I could make a fashionable bracelet. Topiaries. Scarecrows? For some reason, placing this straw buddy by your fields make you feel a little bit safer. <laughs> uh, oh, a cloth maker. That's what we can use our yarn in. And we never did make a cheese maker. Seed makers. Yeah, we need gold for the seed makers. Wait. Can I make any boxes with the stuff currently in my possession? No? Uh, oh, but, excuse me, carrot. Let's see. No, no. Yeah, we got space for what we need anyway. There we go. You gotta go.
go mining. We have to. I mean, we don't really have a choice. We need gold specifically. Oh, jeez. All of you get out of the way. I need gold. Oh, that's a gold rock. Couldn't tell. It was so small and puny. Yeah. Give me your spoils. I figured out why I was seeing blue. Also, it was because... Excuse you, sir. You dang dingus. Yeah. So, in my grinding in future, I will do some mining between... <laughs> oh jeez, that dropped us all the way to 13. I forgot that that was a thing, you know? So much for mining. Since we're going to paint at 6 p.m. Does my gold hoe get me more gold? No, but it'll sure get... All right, you turd. You don't see me going around bopping you for no reason. When I bop you, it's because you tried to bop me first. These moles are the worst. Thirty-seven. Let's get a couple more. I want to get up to fifty. Thirteen more. Okay, so that's four. So nine more is what we want. Hopefully I don't take damage if they pop up after I've left. Four more, so we want five more. It's gonna be so close. What can I eat? Oh, you turn. I'm not leaving this mine without 50 gold. Also, for whatever reason, it saves me a lot of time to go down a level before going back all the way up to the top. Because game logic. 53. Hmm. So, we're going to move the fleet, as much of it as possible anyway. I don't know, should we put the fleet in here? I mean, surely we're not going to use this whole area for crops, like maybe this first half and then the other side can be for the fleet. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. Oh wait, no, I only want the empty ones. Whoops.
problem is that at some point I'm gonna move those boxes as well. And that's not gonna be a pretty time. Goat milk, milk. Milk plus, so three star milk plus sells for 351. Three star regular milk sells for, so it sells for double. Eggplant. So yeah, and once we've got 10 of each of these, I mean, that's the goal, right? Or how are the maximum number of each of these? Whoops. Okay. Let's go start moving the fleet. Because this doesn't appear to take energy, so we're good. <sighs> oh, it's not gonna be good when something's in my freaking way, though. And also, there's not nearly enough space, I can tell you that already. Um, shoot. Alright. Here's gonna go the fleet. Okay, so. Lumber can go there. Jewels can go here. Butter can go here. Your lumber. Get in the lumber line. You're also lumber, but uh, you can't get in the lumber line, so. Ingots. Well, this looks like a job for the ingot maker line. That'll do. Textile. I had a jewel maker over here, yeah? Here we go. Jewel maker. Jewel maker. Bricks and yogurt. Okay, looks like that's where a brick maker wants to go. Yes, I know I'm skipping spaces because I don't have the energy right now to uh, clear the stuff that's there and in the way. So we're just going around them because we know we're going to eventually have 10 of everything. Which means that we're going to eventually have 10 of everything. And, and anyway, we're going to fill the spaces and that's what I meant to say. We're gonna have ten of everything means that we're gonna have ten of everything. Nothing yet? Okay, that's fine. Give. Give. Because I could pick those up and it would spit out the stuff that, uh, is inside of them. I would get my stuff back, but I would lose any time that they've worked up towards. And we don't want to lose time. That would be a very silly thing. Alrighty. Hello, horse. Lumber maker. There we go. Okay, what else we got? Butter maker. Got any butter? Butter. 
Oh, interesting. Uh, fine, you can go with the yogurt maker for now, but don't expect to stay there. Because this whole side is going to be makers eventually. This is the plan, anyway. Nothing even matters. You want anything that I've got? Probably not. I don't have much stuff on me. It doesn't make goat yogurt. Doesn't make goat butter. <sighs> okay. What else do I have? Oh, I've got another lumber maker. I didn't even realize. And another mayo maker. Come on, mayonnaise. We're gonna clear this stuff out eventually, but for now, space is a little tight. <laughs> Alright, let's go sleep. Oh, it's 1.20 in the morning! Why did no one tell me? Eh, it's because there's no one here. Ah! It's okay. Everything's gonna be okay. Every little thing is gonna be alright. Hopefully it rains tomorrow. That's all I care about. Just rain tomorrow, please. Could you please just maybe rain tomorrow? Hi! It's me! Remember, bed? Sometimes I sleep in you. Look, for just being vegetables, I mean, 20,000 in a day ain't bad. Okay. Slept late. Uh, that makes sense. We didn't get all of our hearts back. Also makes sense. Sometimes you just gotta deal with it. Hey, Skunky, let me pet you. <laughs> Seed maker. Maybe I'll keep the seed makers right next to the farm, though. That would make the most sense, right? Yeah, the seed makers can stay right here. Yeah. And... Have some egg plants. Why didn't I complete this square that I already started? Because I'm a big dumb idiot, don't you know? Alright, so... I guess we'll start in the back and work our way forward. Let out our animals, care for them. Start chippy chopping. Hi, babes. Hi, babes. Hi, babes. <coughs> Good morning. Welcome outside. Okay, thanks. Eggs? Many thanks. There we go. I'm gonna end up having, like, a box for grasses and a box for logs and a box for rocks and, and, and I'm gonna have specific different boxes for everything. Eventually this is gonna be a super farm with super stuff. Which frankly is probably ideal. 
Let me milk you, Pebble. Let me give you love, Pebble. I don't want to be holding a camera while I'm trying to milk the animals. Ooh, automatic feeder. Oh, yes, yes, yes. The automatic, okay, you've unlocked the recipe for the automatic feeder. The automatic feeder will distribute fodder to your animal's feed bins each morning. Oh. No, that's good. Wait, yeah, that's good. But that means that I have to be growing fodder on the regular, which means I need to be, you know, buying fodder seeds. They're getting so much happiness and joy. You see all these just stars popping out of heads left and right. My babies love being outside. Uh, good job, Emerald. Thank you for the milk. Hmm. Anyway, let's clear up this stuff. Bonk. Hey, sheepy beepy. I'm probably gonna move the silo and put more barns there. I'm not gonna worry about the tree stumps at this point in time. But everything else, yes, I will worry about. Because, yeah, see, I don't have the energy to get tree stumps as well as. They're just. Because of the, from the durable trees. Which means that they take a lot of energy to bust stuff. Which is fine every here and there, but it's not what I need right now. When I have them done tightening up in I probably shouldn't worry about the big palms either because these ones. Oh, you know what? I need to get my gold and get that started. So, first trip back, one for a bad school. Okay, I hear the dang monkeys. Oh, I do have pictures of the monkeys. Okay, I don't care. Excuse you, you adorable monkeys. Stay out of my makers. You better not be causing mischief and trouble. Yeah, because if we can clear a little bit out of the back and everything out of the front two areas... Then we'll be ahead. Whoa! What kind of tree was that? Interesting. Okay. I mean, I know those are just stumps, but. Doing wonders. Doing wonders on the old farm. I'll take it. Nope, wait, stop everything. I have to buy fodder seeds. And then I need to come back and actually water my crops. Before I use up all my energy. Like a big dumb idiot. You know, me, a big dumb idiot. Oh crap. Uh, stuff, things. Go away, go away. Lovely. We 
love to see it. Okay, go. This is insane. Mad dash to the store to get fodder seeds so that I can, you know, feed my animals the next time it rains. Oh, you know what? Yeah, this might be important. Oh, Lexiac, now that you're here, we can begin the ceremony. <laughs> Thank you all so much for participating in the second roadway and lamp beautification campaign. Our results are in. Yes, finally. Yay. We received some wonderful designs from you all. It was tough to narrow our entries down, but we have our winners. Ooh. The winner of the road category, who will have their design used in town, is none other than Cindy. Congratulations! H I won! Ooh. And the lamp design we'll be using belongs to... Mikey! Alright! We have made we have many other winning ideas that will be incorporated to make all of town more fun. Thanks in part to quite a lot of you. Yes, congratulations. Quite a lot of us have names, you know. We worked so hard on those concepts, too. My apologies, was I meant to say was our winners are Angela, the general store owner with a smile that warms the hearts of her regulars. Oh stop. The ever cheerful Sally. Hooray, hooray! The eternally youthful Jesse. My, my, that's quite the silver tongue you have there, Victor. Our local ex-pirate, Jason. Oh, someone finally acknowledges my true profession. Oh, Jason. Mr. Mayor, don't egg him on like that, otherwise he really is going to think he's an ex-pirate. And last but not least, our favorite farmer, whose presence makes everybody stay that much better. Let's hear it for Lexiac. Without whom, nothing would be left standing in this town. And that concludes our ceremony. Let's all work together and build our olive town into an even better place. What do you say, folks? I say yay! Good job, Mikey. Knew you had it in you. Thankfully, that didn't actually take up any time. Ah. I'm here for things. Better make it 30. And let's buy some fodder to hold us over. Until those grow. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so. Fodder seeds, and I'll build a well over here too. You know? That'll be important. We need the fodder more than we need the free water. That's not true. We don't need anything more than we need our stuff to be watered for me. Game! Drift! Oh, that was 30 already? Dang. Well, shoot. Alrighty. Well, 
let's go water all our stuff. more sprinklers that I made. I feel so stupid. There we go. So starting tomorrow, these ones will already be watered. Excuse you, I... Go away! Thank you. Now! As you were. So close. I guess I could just make more sprinklers, but I don't know. That seems seems like work. Okay. So. I hope one day without water doesn't kill the plants. Ugh. This is why sprinklers... Forgive my intrusion so early in the morning, Lady Lexiac. I came to I'm come to inform you of one of our local festivals. In three days' time, we shall be, shall be ha holding our annual mushroom hunt. As its name implies, it is a festival that honors the act of mushroom gathering. Though the mushrooms we collect are merely toy models, it is a joyous celebration all the same. Will you be joining us as well, Lady Lexiac? Of course. Very well. I look forward to seeing you there in three days. Thank you, Desensu. So it's the egg hunt. Crops, then animals, then everything else. Just how much of a big dumb idiot can one Marley be?
that's everything here, right? Yes, indeed. <sighs> okay. They appear to still be standing. Thank you, game. For going easy on me. I appreciate that. Jeez, the farm gets overgrown so fast. You spend one day in the mines. You ignore your chores for three days and suddenly there's a forest in your farm. And I mean, I know in this game, three days is basically a, like two weeks, but still... Okay, so next is animals, and then we go yeah. forward again. And then, if we run out of energy, we go buy food. That's what yeah. it's for. We have a fridge full of this stuff. My god. And if they didn't give you the, uh, one second. Okay. Um, and if it didn't give me the, I'm about to pass out warning with four hearts left, this wouldn't be so much of a problem. I would pay more attention to it. Oof. Sorry, had to pop my back. <laughs> Alrighty. <clears throat> Goat milk. Thanks, Petty. And most likely this will be the last day of the stream, but it really depends on how I'm feeling. We might do one more. Oh, yeah, right? You need some brushing? Okay, well. Everyone's so happy. I mean, holy moly, they're gaining stars left and right. They really like being outside on these lovely autumn days. There we go. Let's have a quick look-see. Let's, let's check on our animals. Alright, 10-10, 10-10, 4-2, ten, 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 but we've only had emerald for like, I mean, a couple of days. Sorry about the mic cut. I'm having a quick conversation. So, oh, yeah. These guys are, I mean, 10, 10, 10 already. No, well, we've had banana for a while, same as carrot, but three star, four stars of friendship, three of happiness. Like, come on, these guys are happy. They're loving their lives. We'll just assume that the chickens are about the same. We got work to do. Hey, banana. Hey, banana. Alrighty. So. Yeah. Oh, my bag is full. Watch this. No, it's not. Give me that stuff. 
Alrighty, let's chop all these dang stumps down. Sorry, Monk Monks. Oh yeah, <laughs> baby. Oh yeah, baby. Bonk. And just like that, that stuff is clear. Oh my gosh, that was amazing. <laughs> You know, we could really clean this stuff up. Oh. Um. All right, all right. Oh, the goat milk gives us two. Regular milk gives you one. Goat milk gives you two. Milk plus gives you three. So goat milk plus will probably give you four or five. Okay. Oh, that's a brick maker. What you got for me? Okay. Okay. I don't have any ingots on my person. Sure. We need more supple log, I believe. Just to get this stuff out of my inventory, you know? There we go. And just like that, we can continue. What? There's a lot to be done still. You know, like, what's this gonna take down? Three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and the stump takes. Yeah, those that mirage stuff ain't kidding around. <sighs> just, I just gotta make sure I check everything every day. Upkeep, preventive care. Well, that's accurate. Upkeep and preventive care are very important. It's not necessarily the best way to talk about playing a video game. <laughs> the, you know, for mirages, these trees are pretty dang tough. See what I'm saying? Oh, now we're full again. Alright, let's go dump our stuff and come on back. Okay, so from here, I think we'll work from the front back. Because we have a lot of, uh... Stuff that needs to get handled. Although, actually, I do want to bring... Hold on. My brain's... Lagging. Oh, I do want to bring. Nope. From here. No. I'm sorry. This, this, this. 
Yes, just those. Uh, wait, and some supple log. It's three per? Yeah, so let's just take... 30 would fill one... 60? No, I only need 30. I'm sorry, my brain's just... There we go. Okay. My brain just... Just not wanting to brain today, you know? You ever just not want to brain? Uh, we've all had those days. Mayonnaise can get sold. Get sold, butter. You too, yogurt. Peppers, eggplants, tomatoes. Yeah. That looks about right. Alright. Okay, well, let's just do our stuff. Okay, so. Let's have at it. Oop. Scoop. Scoop. Okay. Good news is that none of this. Shit. I know, it's not worth it. None of this takes long, because this is first area stuff. And I've got third area tools. And hopefully, once more and more of my land gets covered, the rest of this will be necessary. Plenty of nope. Those are those are orchard. I'm gonna chop one of them down one day by accident and be devastated. Really is what's gonna happen. I'm just gonna die. I'm just gonna die because I'm gonna feel so bad for chopping up my plant. Like how normal people talk about plants. That was the point. That was that was the entire joke. <laughs> Chad's over here ruining my jokes. Cause like the ponds or the puddles rather. And the grass, I'll take a single scoop, single swing, scoop, whatever, regardless. And now that I have the big fancy axe and the big fancy hammer, so too do the trees and rocks in both of the first areas. In the first two areas are the words that I meant to speak. Oh, my bag's full. Whoopsie! Uh. <sighs> it's fine. Everything is fine.
Okay. Let us continue. Let's pick up my grass. Alrighty. Watering can. Okay, I'm gonna stop disappearing now. Oh, wait. That's right. Don't pick things. No pick, just chop. Get all the trees. Let's start with all the trees. Uh oh. Frames! Because the stuff that wants to be picked, I can pick tomorrow. But if I pick it today and then leave it on the ground, I can't pick it up tomorrow because it'll vanish. But if I just don't pick it in the first place. It won't do a heck of vanish. See. <laughs> Get more seeds, I think. <laughs> Wait. More seeds means more seeds need to be planted. I'll do it tomorrow. We're gonna go to bed. Go bed. Before we faint. Um. Oh crap. Wait, I meant to go start up my stuff. Let's go start up all the stuff and then go to bed. And then uh we're probably gonna call it for the stream. It's getting pretty late. Tomorrow we're gonna do the the long long stream. Don't you worry, friends and fam. More supple lugs. Supple is how I like my lugs. else did I want to... Oh. No, the mayo makers are over here. Mayo, mayo, mayo! Stupid now. <gasps> and now I can do all the stupid stuff I want. See? Okay, so I hope that you've enjoyed yourself half as much as I did. Because I enjoyed myself quite a bit. Um, don't forget to like this video if you liked the video. Stream. You know. Uh, subscribe if you haven't yet. Because 
That's what we're here for. Having a good time together. And um, if you really want to hang out, make sure you hit the notification bell because I stream at random times, sometimes during the day and sometimes at night. So thank you for being here. Drop a comment down below. Let me know uh, which seasonal garden I should get access to first. And until next time, my friends. Peace.